Hello and welcome to the Philippines. Uh, there was a big fire that broke out Friday night between 9 and 10 p.m. I believe. Uh, third floor of Metro, uh, which is in uh, Ayala Mall. Metro, I believe, is owned by the, the grocery store and some of the other stores. is owned by Gaisano, I believe, uh, which is a big uh, supermarket and uh, mall operator here in the Philippines. Um, it turned into a uh, big fire. The mall is closed at this time. It's Sunday morning here. And uh, I believe close to midnight last night, it started up again. They thought they had it contained or close to contained, and uh, some winds come up and uh, helped to spark it. One of the problems in containing the blaze was that they had a very limited number of breathing apparatus uh, so that and, and the dense smoke inside of the building inside of the mall was so thick they couldn't see uh, therefore they they were unable to get inside and try to attack it from the inside uh, anyway they I believe the uh, mall will be closed at least for a number of days uh, not sure about that the article I just read here Sunday morning said that other stores were not damaged in the process, but I would think that uh, smoke damage has to be, uh, especially in that region, I would think that the smoke got out and, and damaged uh, a lot of the products in a lot of the stores. There will be an investigation, of course, and uh, one of the questions is whether this sprinkler system was working. I took this video about 20 hours after the fire had started, so it's uh, it's Saturday and it started uh, Sunday night, it's late Saturday afternoon. They're using backhoes to try to break through the walls uh, so they can get water into the building. I've seen a number of water trucks here, so uh, I don't know if they don't have enough water hydrants uh, to deal with this type of situation or the water pressure isn't great enough or what the issue was. But you always see uh, several water trucks following the uh, fire trucks. The wind was blowing the smoke uh, down towards uh, Fuente Osmina Circle, Mango Bay area, and as I walked that way, well here you can see the smoke uh, um, a few blocks away there. And this was an all-alarm fire basically, which meant that all the fire departments from uh, Danao City in the north to uh, further south, quite a ways south, were asked to respond. The tall building there is Horizon 101 condominium, mixed use, uh, and uh, you can see the haze there, the smoke even down here. Uh, I'm sure they will want to open the mall as soon as they can. I don't know when that will be. Anyway, thank you for coming along. Please like, share, and subscribe. Uh, safe travels to you all, and we'll see you next time.